Hi friends, in this video, I'm gonna make a simple RF remote relay switch using a few common components. It is very easy to rebuild this project. I hope you will enjoy this video. So without further ado, let's start this video. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, then do subscribe and don't forget to press the bell icon so you can get notifications whenever I upload a new video. These are my other channels, do subscribe them as well. And you can also follow me on Facebook and Instagram component list, circuit diagram, everything is in the description below. These are all the components we gonna need for this project. Let's make the receiver circuit. First, I'm gonna connect CD4017IC and connect its pin number 4 and its pin number 15 together, its pin number 8 and 13 to ground and its pin number 16 to positive supply. After that, I'm gonna connect a 433 MHz RF receiver and connect its VCC pin to positive supply and its ground pin to ground. After that, I'm gonna connect a 10K resistor and connect its one pin to data pin of RF receiver and its other pin to pin number 14 of the IC. After that, I'm gonna connect a 10 microfarad capacitor and connect its positive pin to pin number 14 of the IC and its negative pin to ground. After that, I'm gonna connect a BC547 transistor and connect its pin number 3 to ground. After that, I'm gonna connect a 1K resistor and connect its one pin to pin number 2 of the IC and its other pin to pin number 2 of the transistor. After that, I'm gonna connect a 5 volt relay and connect its one coil pin to pin number 1 of the transistor and its other coil pin to positive supply. After that, I'm gonna connect a 2 pin terminal block and connect its one pin to normally open terminal of the relay and its other pin to common terminal of the relay. After that, I'm gonna connect a 1N4148 diode and connect its anode to pin number 1 of the transistor and its cathode to positive supply. After that, I'm gonna connect a 100 ohm resistor and connect its one pin to positive supply. After that, I'm gonna connect an LED and connect its anode to remaining pin of the resistor and its cathode to pin number 1 of the transistor. After that, I'm gonna connect a 100 nanofarad capacitor and connect its one pin to positive supply and its other pin to ground. After that, I'm gonna connect a 100 microfarad capacitor and connect its positive pin to positive supply and its negative pin to ground. Now let's make the transmitter circuit. Now let's make the remote circuit. First connect 433 MHz RF transmitter and connect its ground pin to ground. After that, connect a 1K resistor and connect its one pin to data pin of the transmitter and its other pin to VCC pin of the transmitter. After that, connect a push button and connect its one pin to VCC pin of the transmitter and its other pin to positive supply. So we have completed all the connections. Now let's test the project.
So that's it for today's video. I hope you have enjoyed this video. For more videos like that, stay tuned and I will see you in the next video.